Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Audrey. And today I have for y'all a Shein Beauty Tools haul. So a huge thank you to Shein for providing these pieces for me. Everything you see here was sent to me from them, but I did pick them out myself. So if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to let you know when I upload a new video. And let's go ahead and get started. by now that Shein has tons of clothing options, shoes, accessories, bags, you name it, men's, kids, women's, plus everything. But they also have tons of beauty tools and gadgets and so many different products that you may not realize that they have. So I wanted to show y'all a few of those items today. So I'm going to go kind of in in categories. So the first one is going to be travel items. So this year or the next few months are going to be really busy for my husband and I. So y'all know he loves to go to comic cons. He loves to go to all kinds of different cons. So we have quite a few things that are planned for the next few months. So we're going to be traveling just a little bit, nothing too crazy, but we are going to be traveling. And so I knew I needed some items to take with me when we do. So the first item that I wanted to show y'all is this little travel bag. So this is how it comes. It is in a plastic bag when you get it. But here it is. You have your little hook here so you can hang it in the bathroom at your hotel or wherever you're staying. And then you've got your little pouch here with the zipper, pockets up here. You've got your pouches here. This is just a really great way to carry everything that you need in your beauty world. So this would also be a really great option if you carry a lot of jewelry and accessories with you. You could get you another one of these and carry those in it. So tons of options with this, but I am definitely going to have my makeup in this <laughs> because I always forget something and that's just the worst. So I don't want to forget anything when I travel because I've done that so many times before. And the great thing about the size of this one is you kind of have to to scale down what you take because I tend to be an overpacker and you can't always do that. So I got this little shower bag to store all of my makeup and everything in. So another item that I got that goes along with the travel section of this is this little five in one makeup brush. Now my box came a little bit smooshed so <laughs> it was kind of all bent up when I got it but it's a five in one makeup brush. I was really interested to see this so it's kind of neat. So this is what it looks like right here. So you have your you have your brush here, more for powder, highlighter, things like that. You just lift that up, put the lid on, and then you push it right back down. Then you have on this end a sponge. So almost like a beauty blender, so you can always do your foundation with that. I wonder, I'm curious if you can wet this. I think you can, but it feels just like a beauty blender type sponge. So there's that. And then take this off and you've got all of your other little brushes. So you've got an angled brush, more for brows or eyeliner. You've got your eyeshadow brush. And then I'm assuming a lip brush right there. So really neat, they're little small, little brushes but they just go right into those little but you've got your little holder right there so five in one little brush set this is really good if like I said you're traveling and you just cannot carry a whole bunch of stuff with you but you still want to put yourself together when you when you're out <laughs> so this is a really good option for traveling and it will fit right into your little travel bag so you've got everything that you need for your tools. So I have a few other pieces that I want to show you that kind of fit in the traveling category. So the first one are these little spray bottles right here here so you get eight of these and if y'all we don't do them anymore but at work we used to give fragrance samples and they would we would make them in these a little bit smaller than this these little vials little spray bottles we don't do those anymore but that's exactly what these are for if you do a face mist or a toner things like that you could always put them in here just get your little label maker or print out some little little labels and put on it um, but mainly fragrance because y'all know you can only travel especially if you fly 
fly, you can only travel with a certain size of fragrance. If it goes over that, chances are they're gonna, they're gonna take it from you. So, and fragrances are very, very expensive. So how you use these, you just take the, that off, fill it up. You can take your perfume and just spray it in here if you want to. Where atomizers usually have that thing, you can kind of pump the fragrance in it. These, you just have to either pour it in or spray it and put that back on and then you take your lid off and then it's ready to use. You can just spray it. Again, it's really good to use for fragrances, toners, face mist, anything like that. Anything that you can think of that can be sprayed, use these for because they come in handy so much. They're just wonderful. So the next thing is very similar to the spray bottles that I just showed you, but I have never used one of these. So I think I'm going to try to fill it up on camera and we'll see how it turns out. <laughs> I don't know. I've never used one. I mean, I've seen companies have sold stuff already in these types of containers. So we will see. So there's the lid. So this is a foundation applicator. So you do have your little brush here that goes on the end. I'm just gonna set that aside so I don't lose it. Now, how do we, we're gonna figure this out. Okay, so, got it, okay. So I took the lid off and then I took the little brush thing off and I grabbed a bottle of foundation from the bathroom so I'm gonna fill this up so it's just an empty vial here so I'm just gonna fill this up I'm gonna use I have the, at work they give us a lot of makeup so um, I'm just gonna put the Estee Lauder double wear in here y'all know I try to stay cruelty free but this was gifted to me so you know I don't want to be wasteful so it is a beautiful foundation but you know what I mean so I'm just gonna fill watch me spill it I'm gonna fill that up and we will see how this works, if this works. There, I almost did it, I almost did it, but I didn't. Okay, so. Okay, so I have that. So I filled it up to the line. I may have put too much in it, I'm not sure. So there is my Estee Lauder foundation in there. I'm just gonna snap that on so there there that is <laughs> and now I think we just twist it until sorry for that noise y'all I think you just twist it until okay so it's lifting up here if y'all can I'm gonna let y'all so that's twisting and it's going up okay here we go so it's starting to It should start coming out sometime. Yep, there it goes. And there it is. There it is. So, I mean, that's pretty good. It did come out a little bit right here, but I think I had actually put too much in it. So I don't think it was, it's faulty or anything. I think it just kind of where I put too much in it. But yeah, there it is. So then you would just do whatever and then use your little travel thing and put it on <laughs> or a beauty blender or your fingers or whatever. So that is a really neat option for your foundation because who wants to travel with a glass bottle of foundation? You know, that bust in your luggage and everything's ruined. So these are really, really neat. And I don't know, I might have to get some more of these because they're actually, that's pretty good. But yeah, if y'all remember Stila lipsticks used to come in an applicator count, the lip stains used to look like that. So it's really, really neat option for traveling. Um, or honestly, if you are a makeup artist and I mean, honestly, if you're a makeup artist and you don't want to carry your whole kit of every color that you've got, you could always fill a few of these up and have what you need. So that is a really, really good option pretty good. I really like those. Those are neat. And so the last item that I wanted to show y'all in the travel category of this video is this little razor set. Now I'll be honest, I have like three of these in my cabinet in there. I use them all the time because I was buying my razors to shave and stuff with but at the Dollar Tree and <laughs> they're just not the best razors. They'll, they'll cut you all up. And so I wanted to try these. So I start about 
about four or five months ago, I tried these for the first time and I've ordered a few since then because they're so good. Y'all, they are so good. So you get this little carrying case right here. So pretty heavy duty case. You get your handle with the blade already in and then you get three extra blades. So, and I mean, for the price, I mean, if you get, I mean, some of the ones at the store that you can get, the sets and stuff, they'll run you a whole lot of money. And for the price for this, and you've got four, right, four blades and then the handle and a little carrying case. So y'all, these are amazing. And I mean, they work really, really well. And just try them. Like I said, I tried it on a whim and I've been buying them ever since love these instead of wasting your money on packs of razors that just are not good get you this get you this and then you just pop that little when once that one's done and you know, getting kind of dull you just pop that off and you pop on a new one and then you're good to go and this easy to travel in don't have to worry about them falling out or anything so now the next section of this haul is going to be beauty tools so the first thing that i want to talk about are some brushes so i got a 20 piece brush set now i have used a few of them because i did do a get ready with me just a little bit ago using these items so that <laughs> so excuse me if some of them have some makeup still in them i just finished that video so again my box kind of got beat up in the bag but that's fine i don't really need the box for anything so 20 brushes came in this set like i said i've used a few of them in a get ready with me just a little bit ago but y'all here they are they are so so nice so well made i mean they're pink handles you've got they're just beautiful and they work so well like i said i used them on this look um, the brow one, I used the brow one today. I mean, they're just beautiful. I do have tons and tons of brushes. Y'all know I've been working in retail cosmetics for about 20 years now. <laughs> so I have tons and tons and tons of brushes, but some of my really older ones, the feral or the metal part right here is starting to loosen up a little bit on some of my favorite ones. Um, so it's time to switch some of them out. So it's really nice to have some more brushes because I haven't bought new makeup brushes in a very long time because like I said, if you take, you know, you take care of them, the ones you have, they'll last you a very long time, but they can only last so long. But yeah, some of mine are starting to fall apart, but I'm really glad that I was able to get these. You get 20 of them. You've got a brush for everything. And the really neat thing is the big brushes in this set come with their own little mesh protectors. Now Shein does sell packs of these on their by themselves. I think you get 50 of them. I'll put a link to those down below too. Um, I'll just get it from their site because they sell a pack of my believe 50 of them. I'll show you one that has one on it already. You just slide it up the handle and then you pull it up and it protects your bristles so if you're traveling if you're a makeup artist again that's a really good thing once you get them all clean and dry put this on it and it's like brand new every time so these are really really good for protecting your brushes and they will last so much longer so I love these again the bigger brushes in this set come with one on each one but they do sell these by themselves so I will get y'all the link for those. And so the next beauty tool set that I wanted to show y'all are these little puffs. So you get a set of 15 of these and y'all, they are the cutest thing ever. Y'all, you get, they come in three different colors all in a pack. I don't like to hear plastic, so I took them out so y'all could see them, but they come in a little bag like this. So you, so you get 15 of them, you get a black one, a beigey cream color, and then pink. And they're just the cutest, cutest little sponges. So if you bake, you could always do under here. You could always highlight with them. You could always do your baking, whatever. Your, you could get you a little sharp line in your bronzer if you want to. Whatever you want to do with them. But these are really, really cute to have. You can actually throw one in your purse if you like to touch up your makeup, you know, after, throughout the day. So you could always turn it around this way and do your powder all over or you can turn it the other way if you need to get in here and get into any little corners or make your little sharp lines and stuff like that. So really cute, very, very soft little puffs. And I know from work, everybody's looking for these and everything is sold out. So really good option if you love makeup and you follow all the trends and all of that. These are pretty big deal right now. So, and they're really good to have again in your makeup kit if you are a makeup artist. These are really, really great items to have because they're very affordable. You can clean them, you can wash them and reuse them once they're dry. 
perfect, perfect for traveling, for anything that you can think of, but they're wonderful pieces to have. And now speaking of makeup applicators, I also have a little set in this cute little pink box. Now, unfortunately y'all, my package, it just got, it was just destroyed, but nothing was broken or anything like that, except for this one thing. My little case is snapped right here in this corner. Y'all can see there's a little piece falling off. There's a little piece falling off. Um, so it kind of got crushed on the way, but that's okay because, yeah, see, it's kind of, <laughs> but look at my makeup sponges. So you get eight makeup sponges in the little case. Hopefully yours would not be broken, but y'all, I love Shein's Beauty Blenders. I love theirs. You have the ones with the flat, so you could do your little, look. So you have all different ones. You've got different shapes in here, different colors. They're so pretty. And y'all, I love Shein's Beauty Blenders. They, they're perfect. And to me, I think I prefer them over the name brand one. They're not quite as floofy as some other ones. So I do have one sitting in water where I just did this get ready with me. And I mean, look how much bigger they get so big. And I've just got it sitting in water because I need to clean it. But love these. They are just, I don't know, they seem to just work a whole lot better for me. It's all a matter of preference, but I love them. And it comes in some little case, y'all. And they do sell, I will link them down below too. I think I may have shown y'all them before. They do sell little plastic makeup sponge holders. So I will link, I'll find a link for those and link them down below. I don't have one right here to show y'all, but they do make those too. And just to protect your beauty blenders, and you can also wash them out, put them in that, and set them out to dry if you want to, just to stand them up. So it's completely up to you how you wanna do that. And so the last set that I wanted to show y'all in the beauty tools category are these little spatula spoons. So love these. I've been wanting to get some of these for the longest time because y'all, I will cut something open in a heartbeat to get the last little bit out. I just believe in getting your money's worth with stuff, especially beauty products and skincare because they're always so expensive. And you just, a lot of times, you may not realize how much of something you have left. You just can't reach it. So the really neat thing about these, I know that y'all probably seen them on TV, different brands have them, but I'm so glad that Shein has these. So on one end, you have your little spatula and one end you have a spoon. So here's the smaller one. Then you've got the medium sized one. And then you've got this big one. So I could definitely use this for conditioner and different hair stuff that you just cannot quite get to because the pump doesn't quite reach and then you just cannot get it. Um, I am loving these. I think they're so neat to have like skincare, makeup, all those things. These little ones, you can get that in there and scrape all around in those jars because a lot of times like glass bottles and things like that you cannot get the last little bit out for nothing so this is a really good way to get your money's worth out of all of your products so love these love the idea of it i just think that those are phenomenal because we have all just thrown away stuff that we really could have gotten several more uses out of and it's just a waste of money and it hurts your heart to, to do that <laughs> so love those little spoon spatulas i think they're really really a good item to have they are made out of silicone so they do bend just a little bit just to get into those little corners and little creases of your bottles so the next part that we're going to get to are nails so i y'all my nails are pretty much destroyed at work. Um, believe it or not, I, I mean, I do work in cosmetics. It's not as glamorous as people think. You have updates and that means tearing up your fingernails, trying to get graphics changed out and getting new products put out. So you have a lot of plastic parts that you have to pull off and all this. So your hands just get destroyed. So I decided that I was going to get some of Shein's nail products. So they're probably going to have to be for another video. I'm not going to put them on right now just because it's it's going to be some work because I've never used them, me personally. <laughs> um, I'll paint mine every now and then, but that's about it. So I may have to save these for another day as far as showing you how I'm going to do them because um, I'm learning. I did I did actually get some nail glue. I heard this was the best brand to get. We'll see. Um, because the Shein ones, they do come with those little sticker nail things, but I remember those from when I was a kid and 
you know, so I did get some nail glue, but I wanted to show y'all the packs that I got. So I got these, they're the ombre little set. I did start to file that one down. That's why it looks a little more oval shaped rather than square. Cause I don't really like the square ones very much, but there's this set here. Then I got these. I thought these were really pretty. I do have a vintage type video coming up soon. So I may actually do these for that. If I do, I'll share that with you. Then I got some red ones. I would definitely file these so they're not quite as square. I like more the almond shape, but I did get some basic little red ones here. And then I thought these would be kind of fun because you can do whatever you want to with them. But again, I've got to learn how to do this stuff. I don't know anything about nails, but there's 250 of them in here. <laughs> so they're just, they're just stacked on top of each other in this little case. Um, and one of the things that I have dealt with, with, try, with just looking at these, they're really, really wide and I have fairly small nails. Like my pinky nail is like not very wide. So a lot of these, these are a little big. So the really neat thing about these, look how small these go to. So I'm really excited to try these, but again, it's going to be for another day. Um, but I will include y'all in that when I figure out what I want to do or how, how I'm going to do it. <laughs> but I do have all of those nails and I wanted to show y'all those, but they're very, very affordable. I, I'm, I'll put the price up here of how much they are, but I mean, you know, you can't find nails for that. I think we have some, the Glamnetic ones. I think they're like $15 for a pack. So, you know, but I'm really excited. I'll have to do a little nail video if y'all are interested in that. Uh, maybe a chit chat so it's not just looking at me doing fingernails. But I think I'll put something together for that pretty soon. So the last piece in this beauty tools haul that I wanted to show y'all are magnetic lashes. I've shown y'all those once or twice before a while back. Um, for this get ready with me video that I just filmed, um, I need, I wanted to do an eye look with lashes. So this set that you see here that I have on now is the smallest or least dramatic of the set. So they just get bigger from here. Um, but this is what it looks like. It comes in this little box right here. It's the magnetic eyeliner eyelash kit. And for some reason, I thought that it came with an eyeliner because it says magnetic eyeliner eyelashes, <laughs> but I should have just read the description because it does not come with its own liner, but I had one from a previous purchase from somewhere else, from somewhere locally. Um, so at least I did have the magnetic liner already or else I wouldn't have been able to show them. So these again, they're the smallest. They were right down here on the bottom. So this little kit comes with, it has a little magnetic strip here that holds the lashes into place when you store them. But as y'all can see, they get pretty dramatic as you go up. They just start getting bigger and bigger and thicker. And you do have this little applicator. I did not use it. It's angled, it is plastic. So I, I do have a metal one somewhere, but I never used it. But this one is plastic, so not, not the best quality in this. Um, and it came with a little mascara wand right here, but it fell out. I think my cat got it. Um, but just a little mask, disposable mascara wand, but I didn't really need that anyway. <laughs> but again, you do get five pairs of magnetic lashes and they do have a pretty wide range. Now, um, I did not cut these or anything. They're not too long because you don't really want to cut them because they have five magnets on each strip. So if you haven't seen them before, I'm going to take one off just so you can see. So there's one, two, three, four, and five. So there's five little magnets and that is what grabs a hold of that magnetic eyeliner. So that's what attaches it. And the great thing about these, you don't have to worry about glue or missing them or anything. When you put that eyeliner on, they just stick, they just suck right to it. <laughs> Typically you do put on the magnetic eyeliner first, which is a liquid eyeliner. Let it dry completely because you don't want it to be tacky or anything. Let it dry completely. And then you just set this up and you can feel it kind of pull to it just like a magnet. And it just pops right on. Then when you're ready to take them off, you just pull them right off and store them in your little storage case. So most magnetic lashes are reusable many, many, many times. Um, I think most of them are around 40 or 50 times. It all depends. I'm not exactly sure about these. 
Um, but I do have some that I believe they say you can use them up to 50 times. You know, as long as you keep them clean, because you do put mascara and stuff just to blend them in. So just keep them clean and you won't have to worry about it. You can have them for a very long time. So I love this little kit. I would say you don't really need this because you just hold them up and it pops right on. But if you do like to use one of those, you may want to get you another one, a metal one, because this one is plastic and it doesn't really work very well. But beautiful, love them. They're really comfortable and very, very nice to finish a look. So y'all, that is all I have for y'all today in this Shein Beauty Tools haul. Again, a, a huge thank you to Shein for providing all of these pieces for me. I love makeup. It's kind of the world that I'm in. So I love trying new things that I haven't already had before. So Shein has really great prices, just like with everything. So give them a look and everything you need will be linked down below along with my coupon code for this haul. It is a special coupon code. So be mindful of that down below. But y'all, if y'all have any questions about anything or if you would like to see a nail try on um get ready with me chit chat whatever just let me know in the comments below as well so y'all thank you so so much for being here and until next time y'all take care of yourselves and take care of each other and i will see you soon